Throughout Germany, there are 17 nuclear power plants, but surprisingly, that number is actually a decrease from a decade ago. In 2010, nuclear power was responsible for nearly a quarter of Germany's total electricity production. But today, nuclear power only makes up about 11% of the country's total energy production. Germany is rapidly shutting down its nuclear power plants, with a goal of closing every single one of them by the end of 2022. While the production of nuclear power reaches record highs across the globe, why is Germany shutting down its plants, and what will our alternative to nuclear power really be? The production of nuclear power has been around since the 1960s, but saw massive growth across the world between the 1970s and 1980s. Nuclear power attracted worldwide attention by being known as a clean and sustainable form of electricity production, and countries were interested. For one, nuclear fission is nearly 8,000 times more efficient at producing energy than traditional fossil fuels. In order to produce power, nuclear plants heat water to produce steam. The steam is then used to spin large turbines that generate electricity. Nuclear power was the future of electricity generation, and Germany was interested. Germany's development of nuclear reactors began in the late 1950s, with the first commercial plant opening in 1969. But the public had mixed opinions about nuclear energy, and were skeptical regarding the safety of the technology. Operating nuclear plants comes along with a lot of risks. For one, nuclear energy produces radioactive waste, which needs to be carefully stored in on-site tanks. There is also the risk of nuclear accidents, which can take entire towns off the map. While all of these arguments against nuclear power were reasonable at the time, governments across the world chose to continue constructing nuclear facilities, despite the public backlash. Germany's anti-nuclear movement began back in the 1970s, when large demonstrations were held opposing the construction of additional nuclear power plants. Throughout this period, the government's support for nuclear power was strong, but things took a drastic turn in 1986. The Chernobyl disaster was a representation of just how dangerous nuclear power really was, and the effects it could have on areas surrounding nuclear facilities. Following the disaster at Chernobyl, regions throughout southern Germany were exposed to a cloud of radioactive fallout. In the years after Chernobyl, Germany would only build one additional nuclear power plant, which would end up being their last. In 1990, the German reunification resulted in East and West Germany joining together to form the German Democratic Republic. Following the signing of the treaty, all nuclear power plants in Eastern Germany were forced to close, due to flaws in safety standards, which only placed more doubt in the safety of nuclear power. Throughout the 1990s, plans were proposed to build additional nuclear plants, but the politically hostile environment in the light of the Chernobyl disaster never allowed plans to materialize. By 2002, the government had decided that they would begin to phase out the commercial use of nuclear power plants by the time they reached their legally defined electricity production volumes. The federal government would then adopt a plan that intended to use nuclear energy as a bridging technology towards more renewable energy production. However, the Fukushima nuclear accident of 2011 once again showed the extreme dangers of nuclear power. After recognizing the sheer scale of the Fukushima disaster, Germany quickly moved to make plans to shut down all 17 of its nuclear power plants by 2022. From the outside, this was a very controversial move, but at the time, opinion on nuclear power remained broadly opposed across Germany. In the years afterward, the government launched the Climate Action Plan 2050. The renewable energy plan would correspond with the closing of 17 nuclear plants by 2022, by slowly decreasing Germany's dependence on nuclear energy. While Germany and its citizens believe that they made the right choice by shutting down nuclear plants, the rest of the world views it as a big mistake. Many critics have pointed out that nuclear energy does not release carbon dioxide, but coal-fired power plants do. Germany currently has six coal-fired power plants in operation, and plans to shut all of them down by 2030. Many have also pointed out that next door in France, they are moving in the complete opposite direction, spending 57 billion US dollars to construct six next-generation nuclear reactors. Currently in 2022, only three nuclear power plants remain in operation in Germany, and plan to be shut down by the end of this year. With Germany's government and its citizens in agreement with the decision to close down the plants, outside opinions may not make the difference. 
By the end of this year, nuclear power may be completely eliminated in Germany, with renewable energy taking over as the primary source of energy within the next few years. While many disagree with the decision to close 17 nuclear power plants, Germany may prove as an example to show how renewable energy can dominate as the main source of electricity for over 80 million residents. If you enjoyed the video, please consider subscribing.